Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we will discuss about uh, how SLR of 1 input string acceptance will be done. In our previous classes, we already discussed about how to construct the LR of 0 items. From that, how to construct the SLR of 1 parsing table. Please watch those classes and come back here. It is a continuation class. Uh, the link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class, we will take an example and understand how the input string is accepted, how we check the acceptance of that input string using the parsing table which we already generated in our last class. This is the table which we constructed in our last class. This is the SLR of one table for our grammar and the numbering for each production is given like this 1, e tends to e plus t, 2, e, ten, e tends to t, third one is t tends to t star f, fourth one is t star f fifth one is f tends to bracket e sixth one is so sixth one is f tends to id these are the productions numbering has been provided like this and with this with using this parsing table we can check for acceptance of the given input string how we check that let's try to understand step by step so we need to understand how shift operation will done and how reduce operation will done if you understand those two steps remaining steps are all same you can follow we will explain half of the example you can continue from there now coming to that we will take a stack on the stack the first input symbol we are going to push is zero zero means we are starting from zero th item zero th state i not state that is what the meaning of this zero here Based on that, we have constructed this. So we are starting from i not state, and the input is like this: id star id plus id. At last, we are adding dollar symbol. So the first action we are taking is shift. Why we are taking it as shift? Zero id. What the table says? Zero id. Shift five. If you want to shift, id is taken to symbols. On to the stack, we have to shift the phi value because fifth state that is that's explained shift to phi means we are moving to fifth state so that's why phi number is shifting to stack symbols now the stack symbols contains of 0 5 and symbols contains of id input consists of star id plus id dollar now 5 star what it says 5 star means reduce to sixth production what is the sixth production f tends to id so reduce to fifth production f tends to id so how the reduce operation will be done you have to understand that f tends to id how many symbols are present on the right hand side of the production f tends to id how many symbols on the right hand side id means one symbol so take out one from the stack means one input from the stack means 5 is popped off okay this is the action you have to do take out one symbol why we are taking one symbol because on the right hand side f tends to id right hand side how many pro productions are how many symbols are there one symbol that's why take one symbol from the one one value from the stack so what's remain on the stack zero zero on f we are reducing to f zero on f so what's the state it is saying third state that's why on the stack we have pushed on to three value this is the reduce action you have to do we will repeat it again because you have to understand this so if you want to reduce five on star is going to reduce the sixth production sixth production means f tends to id so how many symbols are present on the right hand side one symbol so pop one element from the stack five is popped off zero on f what's our table says three value so we are pushing three onto the stack zero three remaining uh, id is uh, transformed to f star id plus id dollar r uh, so what's the next action it is going to take third state on star symbol third on star symbol reduced to four what is reduced to four says t tends to f so t tends to f how many symbols are present on the right hand side one symbol what we have to do pop one element from the stack if you want to pop means what's the topest element third element so three has been popped from the stack zero on t zero on t what it says two 
so that's why we are uh, we are pushing two onto the stack f is converted to t star id plus id dollar now again check two on star two on star shift seven shift seven what shift action means star is pushed on, uh, star is uh, placed here and seven is pushed onto the stack seven id seven id shift five means id is shifted here five is pushed onto the stack that is what the action next one is a five plus five plus means reduce to sixth production what is the sixth production f tends to id how many symbols are there on the right hand side one symbol so pop one element from the stack five is popped off seven on f this is what we are going to reduce seven on f means seven on f means 10 that's why stack consists of 0 2 7 and 10 elements id is converted to f t star f plus id dollar so what's the action we have to do 10 on plus 10 on plus reduce to third symbol what is the third symbol t tends to t star f 10 on plus means t tends to t star f this is the point you have to understand how many symbols are present on the right hand side of the stack three symbols are present on the stack uh, on the uh, right hand side of the production so how many elements you have to pop from the stack three elements has to be popped off 10 7 2 what's remaining 0 0 on t 0 on t so it is saying 2 push 2 onto the stack that's why the stack contains 0 2 similarly we have to complete on the end one on dollar what's one on dollar says accepted this is how it is going to accept the given input string like that you keep some continuing expanding this you will understand you keep doing that that's the better practice hope you understand the concept of how we are using this table to uh, identify the acceptance of the given input string using slr of one parsing table if you have any questions regarding the concept, please post your questions in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you.